The designers claim to have pioneered the incorporation of a 30-inch wheel on motorcycle and subsequently pushed boundaries by creating a hubless variation. The electric-powered model showcased on the screen promises a unique riding experience. Although specific details of the endeavor are not divulged, it is understood that one of the fuel-powered prototypes required a duration of five months for development and featured a 1.8-liter engine. Overall, the primary focus of this project is centered on fashion rather than velocity. Audi, the German automobile manufacturer, has revealed an innovative concept vehicle that showcases their vision for premium mobility in the future. The vehicle is called the Active Sphere, and it has the ability to transform into a pickup truck, making it an ideal choice for outdoor activities and off-road adventures. With a ground clearance that can be adjusted from 208 to 248 millimeters, it provides ample room for bicycles and a ski rack on the roof. The car is powered by two electric motors, delivering a combined output of 442 horsepower, and it can travel up to 600 kilometers on a single charge. Apart from its impressive performance, the Active Sphere boasts of an upgraded interior that incorporates cutting edge technology. Instead of traditional screens, the driver and passengers are provided with augmented reality AR, glasses that allow them to access and control various elements of the car. For instance, by looking at the speakers, they can view and adjust the volume settings. Although the Active Sphere will not be manufactured, Audi plans to incorporate some of its features in their upcoming models. Commencing with a statement that the Mukabe Cubic Skyscraper serves as the gateway to a whole new world, the project is poised to become the fresh base of Riyadh, Saudi Arabia's capital city, by 2030. This undertaking is indeed an ambitious one, given that the skyscraper will span over 2 million square meters, with each side measuring 400 meters. To give a sense of scale, it can fit 20 Empire State Buildings within its confines, almost like a city within a city. The structure is slated to feature an array of amenities, including malls, hotels, theaters, offices, museums, and even an opera house, ensuring that residents and visitors alike will have plenty to keep them engaged. One of the most notable features of the Mukabe Cubic Skyscraper is a spiral tower situated within the cube, which is both incredibly impressive and exorbitantly expensive with conservative estimates suggesting that the project and the surrounding area will cost $48 billion. It is clear that no expense will be spared to bring this vision to life. Moving beyond our planet's roads, let's set our sights on the moon where greenhouse pods will soon be sent. As part of the plan, a test run of plant growth will take place on Earth this year with the ultimate goal of sending the pods to the moon by 2027. The dimensions of the greenhouse pods are 11 by 6 by 5 meters, and they will utilize advanced hydroponics technology, eliminating the need for soil. Additionally, a fully autonomous control system will ensure that all plants receive optimal conditions, including humidity, temperature, and other necessary parameters. NASA has already expressed interest in the project and the creators have noted that the technology will also have applications here on Earth. Nissan made headlines a few years back when they announced their plans to invest roughly $18 billion in the development of new electric vehicles. Among their surprises was a virtual concept of an electric convertible, which is now materialized into a real-life, full-scale prototype. While the vehicle's specifications are public knowledge, what sets it apart is its unique blend of an 80s-inspired aesthetic with modern electric motor technology, including the specially designed E-Force all-wheel drive system for electric vehicles. With the Nissan LEAF, which uses this system, having achieved a test output of 304 horsepower, it is expected that the convertible will produce similar results. Nissan has already announced plans to create 15 new all-electric vehicles by 2030, and the question remains whether this convertible will be included in that lineup.
Described as a vehicle tailored for a potential RoboCop sequel and a bleak future that looms ahead, this concept has received praise for its design. The trike steering and maneuvering capabilities strike an ideal balance, making it an excellent choice for pursuing criminals, a feature that Officer Alex Murphy would have surely appreciated. In addition to its impressive performance, the trike is also equipped with self-driving technology that enables it to operate in fully autonomous mode. This means that law enforcement officers wouldn't even need to ride the vehicle. It can patrol on its own. Furthermore, if the situation calls for it, the trike can switch to other tasks, such as delivering food or participating in races. Exploring beyond hypercars, Bugatti has delved into experimenting with trucks and SUVs. This unconventional venture was born out of the manufacturer's curiosity as they pondered the outcome of creating vehicles beyond their usual realm. Utilizing the power of artificial intelligence, they received various designs of Bugatti cars, ranging from an extreme e-racing off-roader to a complete truck. As we check in on the latest developments from La Serini, the Italian designers have yet again impressed with their remarkable new project. This time, they've unveiled a hydrogen-powered superyacht concept, boasting a whopping 15,000 horsepower capacity. Measuring an opulent 74 majors, the vessel is equipped with a lightweight carbon fiber hull and adaptable hydrofoils, enabling it to achieve impressive speeds of up to 139 km per hour. With four decks, seven luxurious cabins, a helipad, swimming pool, and various other lavish amenities, there's no shortage of comfort and extravagance on board. Of course, anyone looking to bring this impressive concept to life will need to have deep pockets, as the estimated cost is around $85 million. Aviation enthusiasts may be familiar with the American team, Boom Supersonic who are focused on developing supersonic planes for commercial aviation. Their latest project, Overture, has generated significant interest from the military due to its impressive performance capabilities. With a maximum speed exceeding 2,000 km per hour, Overture has the potential to fly from Miami to London in under five hours. In contrast, a direct flight operated by American Airlines currently takes over eight hours Overture has a passenger capacity of 65 to 85 people and can travel up to 7,800 kilometers on a single flight. Boom Supersonic aims to commence production of Overture by 2025 and plans to launch scheduled flights by 2029. This innovative aircraft is set to revolutionize the aviation industry and transform long-haul travel for passengers around the world. If you have no desire to reside in a desert, perhaps the ocean is a more appealing option. Production of these pods has already commenced, with approximately 100 units expected to be completed by the end of this year. The cost of each pod varies depending on the size and features, ranging from $295,000 to $1.5 million. The 73 square meter version is designed with three levels, including a bedroom, living room, kitchen, bathroom, and storeroom. For those who require more space, an additional BBQ party module can be added, increasing the area by approximately 20%. The owner can control various aspects of the pod with a simple wave of their hand, thanks to a specialized smart ring. The pod is positioned 2.2 meters above the water, necessitating the use of drones for deliveries. Autonomous vessels will be utilized for transporting both small and large items. As part of the People's Car Project competition, about 120,000 participants submitted their innovative designs. Among the top three finalists was a concept resembling a car key FOB, which turned out to be a mobile camper capable of seating up to five passengers. The interior of this innovative vehicle featured folding beds, a toilet, and solar panels for powering its components. Meanwhile, the other finalist concept, which bore the Volkswagen logo, was an A2C vehicle intended for use on electromagnetic roads. This pod hovered above the roadway and was controlled by a joystick. 
Additionally, it boasted an automatic accident prevention system. Both of these designs showcased innovative and imaginative approaches to transportation that wowed the competition's judges. The House on Wheels has already become a reality, with its luxurious features and a price tag of approximately $3 million. This model has been recognized as the most opulent in the world by 190 countries, offering a powerful engine of up to 600 horsepower, a length of 13.7 meters, a well-equipped kitchen, a shower, a cozy living room, and all the essential appliances. As you step inside this extraordinary vehicle, you may easily mistake it for a lavish hotel room, complete with all the amenities you would expect. The exterior is equally impressive, as the designers have brilliantly incorporated elements from the worlds of aviation, yachting, and motorsports, resulting in a unique and visually stunning design. The massive number of gamers worldwide has surpassed the 3 billion mark by the end of 2021. Considering this staggering figure, why not create a special vehicle tailored to meet the needs of this huge audience? This concept would undoubtedly be every gamer's ultimate fantasy come true. Its exterior design is reminiscent of top-of-the-line computers, while the interior is optimized for a fully immersive gaming experience. The vehicle's centerpiece is a massive projection display that will help you locate all the Easter eggs hidden within your favorite gaming universe. Moreover, not only will they be added to your player profile, but it will also allow you to customize the light elements on the car's body in a unique and special way. You can even control the vehicle using your smartphone and the panoramic view offers stunning city views while you update or pause your game. In essence, the idea is to create a one-of-a-kind vehicle that provides a fully integrated gaming experience on the go, combining your passion for gaming with the freedom of mobility. Puget has provided an answer to the question of what the environmentally friendly car of the future should look like with their prototype named The Movie. This design was the winning entry in the annual Puget Design Competition, surpassing over 3,000 participants from 107 countries. Not only was it presented as a concept, but a full-size prototype was also produced. The movie is an impressive vehicle, built in just three months, and instantly grabs attention with its unique features. One of the standout features is the oversized rear wheels and front spheres, which are said to improve the car's maneuverability. The dimensions of the vehicle also support this claim, measuring at 2.3 meters long and 1.8 meters wide. It is powered by an electric engine, and its cabin can accommodate two people while providing a stunning view. In summary, Puget's movie prototype is an exceptional example of an environmentally friendly car of the future. Its distinctive design elements and electric engine make it a standout option for those looking to minimize their carbon footprint while traveling in style. And in case of fire, we found this concept of a futuristic fire truck. We wonder if it can be paired with the previous vehicle. As skyscrapers continue to rise to even greater heights, the need for innovative ways to navigate these towering structures becomes increasingly important. Recently, at the Consumer Electronics Show in the United States, a fascinating concept was showcased that may provide a solution. The idea is elegantly simple. Pods that glide smoothly between floors, much like an elevator. But on the ground, they connect to a special base and move like a bus. The designers of this concept claim that it is both visionary and realistic, taking into account the needs of both passengers and pedestrians. For passengers, the pods will offer a variety of useful information and entertainment during their travels, while for pedestrians, the transport will pause at crossings to allow them to pass. Overall, this new concept could revolutionize the way we move around large buildings, making the experience faster, safer, and more enjoyable for everyone involved. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more content. We'll see you in the next video.